Twas the night before Christmas, the story was told. And our dear friend Stan was feeling a bit old. The whole North Pole gang tried to make him feel better. But all he could think was the cold winter weather. And as every new day brought more ice and snow. Santa wished for a warm place to go. Fortune and below and it's still dropping. It's going to be full on tonight. Seems like winter gets worse every week. Oh, my back. This arthritis is killing me. What am I going to do? Don't worry, Santa. We'll take care of these toys. You just bundle up under this blanket. That's right, Santa. Just try to stay warm. Here's some last minute Christmas letters for you to read. Jingle, I want you to take over all the flower preparations for Christmas Eve. That's less than a month away, and Santa needs to be in tip top shape. You got it, Mrs. C. Jingle. You rang? Go shovel some more coal into the furnace. It's freezing in here. Holly. Yo. Go shovel some more. Go get a group of elves to go clear the runway. We can't get snow in this close. It's a big day. Come on, elves. Let's go. Hey, Jingle, don't you think that Rudolph and the gang need a little extra hay in this cold winter weather? Good thinking, Mistletoe. All right, I was back to work. You know, and a single boy will go out to be disappointed this Christmas. They sent us more and more letters than ever. destination of your choice, Orlando, the Bahamas, Hawaii, oh, Mrs. Claus, anything if I could just bask in the sun on the beach. Yes, I can see us now, but you do know you have to work during the winter, the children are depending on you. I suppose you're right, but it's still a thing to dream about. I cruise the Caribbean, spend all day in the sun. At night I boogie down and really have some fun.
share, Wally. How can we possibly increase our market share as long as Santa Claus is in the picture? You're right, Mr. Beardy. Absolutely right. Thousands of dollars in computer equipment, the best possible marketing techniques. I agree, sir. Top of the line. Top of the line. Always did not even any good as long as Santa Claus is simply giving toys away. Giving them away. Just giving them away. How can we get rid of Santa Claus and his unfair trade advantage? Answer me that. Uh, Mr. Beardy, sir? It's almost time for that tour group from Oak Valley School. All right, the little brat. Here's today's mail, Mr. Grimley. All right, children, move along. This is our main shipping facility. As you can see, Grimley's toys are in great demand world over. <laughs> Excuse me, Mrs. Marka, but when do we get to the part of the tour where we get to buy some toys? Just follow me, boys and girls. Our retail showroom is just ahead. We take MasterCard, Visa, and American Express. In case you forget anything, you can order on our 24 hour a day on our 800 number. Oops, I didn't see those boxes. Oh, Kevin, you're so clumsy. Here, let me help you. Thanks, Ellen. Now, as I was saying, how can we get Santa Claus out of the toy business? Look at this letter, Mr. Billy, sir. Win a fabulous vacation to an exotic destination of your choice. The Bahamas, Orlando, Hawaii. Mr. Billy, this gives me an idea of getting rid of the Santa Claus competition. Oh, I'm listening, Wally. Tell me more. Did you hear that, Kevin? I sure did. If their plan works, Santa's in big trouble. We've got to do something. Well, what can we do? Look at these packages being mailed. We could just mail ourselves to the North Pole. Mail ourselves in boxes? Are you crazy? Yeah. It won't be too bad. We'll just go overnight by express mail. Plus, it's to save Santa from these creeps. All right, I suppose. Here's a box that's about our size. Get in. I'll fill out the mailing label. There, Santa. Just take a little sip of this hot cocoa to warm you up, and I know you'll feel better. Who could that be? Wait a second. Who are you? You're not supposed to be here. Don't just wait! Santa Claus, Santa Claus this is your lucky day. We're from NASA for Fun and Family Sweepstakes, and you've been random, randomly selected by our World Life Computer Network as a winner to a fabulous vacation to a destination paradise. Oh my! Santa, 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 you're a winner. This is your lucky day. Don't worry if you feel like a beginner. We'll show you how you can really play. Just answer the question, then you're on your way to a fabulous super duper holiday. Santa, 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 you're a winner. This is your lucky day. Vacation number one includes two wonderful weeks at the luxurious Lake Key Major Resort with unlimited shuffleboard and all the miniature golf you can play. I'll try vacation number two. Just answer, just answer question number one. What color is Rudolph's nose? Huh, why red, of course.
Would you like to keep vacation number two? Or would you like to try for the National Farm and Family Sweepstakes Grand Prize? Two weeks in the sun at the beach at Paradise Island. Two weeks in the sun? Oh, I'll try for the grand prize. Okay, <coughs> for the grand prize. On the first day of Christmas, my true love gave to me a partridge in what kind of tree? Oh my goodness, apples, bananas, oranges, oats, some kind of fruit, mangoes, cherries, pear! You're a grand prize winner!
right away. Ellen, I think we're here. This must be the North Pole. Thank you. 